Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix in case uh, if you don't see icons or if the taskbar is blank on your Windows 11 machine. Now, in my case, um, I wouldn't be able to go ahead and reproduce this issue because uh, I don't have issues. However, um, you might see that, you know, after installing updates or when you restart the computer, the task might taskbar might go blank now there are a couple of fixes you need to try the first and foremost fix what you will have to do is you will have to op uh, go ahead and uh, open the task manager how to do it you will have to press Control shift escape on your keyboard simultaneously i will put those um, steps or the command shortcut keys in the video description so as soon as you press Control shift escape you will see task manager on your uh, screen as soon as you see if you see the task manager in this way what you will have to do is you will have to click on more details as soon as you click on more details under this section go ahead and uh, select for details under details look for windows explorer it would be in alphabetical order or you can look for explorer.exe in case if you see it what you can do is you can do a right click click on end task click on end process go ahead and restart the computer um, you can do a hard reboot um, that sh uh, or and uh, check if it is working in case if you're not able to do a hard reboot you can keep on pressing windows key on your keyboard and uh, as, as you press windows key the task bar or the uh, explorer should come up in case if it doesn't come up what you can do is you can go to file click on run new task and type explorer dot exe click on ok so that will that should bring back the uh, taskbar or uh, on your taskbar on your uh, computer screen now this is one step what you can try in case if this doesn't fix a problem the next step, what I would suggest you is open the taskbar again. Once you restart the computer, open the taskbar using the shortcut on your keyboard, which is Control Shift Escape. And um, in case if you don't see the window, in case if you are on this portion of the window, click on More Details. Under once you have this section, you will see the menu bar at the top left corner. Click on File. Click on Run New Task. Once you click on run new task, what you can do is you can go ahead and type CMD, which is the command prompt and click on OK. As soon as you click on OK, uh, what you can do is you will have to run this command. This is uh, right to uh, run this command. I will put this command in the video description. You can pick it up from there. As soon as you run this command, hit enter. Your computer will shut down and restart in case if it doesn't restart uh, try to restart the computer manually using the power button and once you restart the computer your windows taskbar or the icons uh, should be restored on your computer now this is the second step now in spite of performing this step if you're still facing a problem the next step what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to go ahead and uh, re-register the start menu how do we do it um, you open the task manager again by using the shortcut Control shift escape now under this section uh, you can press uh, and uh, type click on run new taskbar and type control and hit enter this should open the control panel under this uh, start section you can go ahead and type power shell in case if you're not able to open power shell the next thing what you can also try is you can press windows key on your keyboard that should open up the menu and uh, you can go ahead and type power shell under this section click on run as administrator in case if you get user access control prompt you may click on yes or continue on the screen so as soon as you have powershell you will have to go ahead and type this command uh, again i will put this command in the video description you can copy and paste this command so 
Once you copy the command from the video description, what you can do is you can do a right click, click on edit and click on paste or you can use control V on your keyboard that should paste the command. Once you paste the command, um, hit enter, that will go ahead and run the command and um, as soon as the command is uh, executed successfully, go ahead and restart the computer and uh, when you restart the computer, you should have your windows taskbar with all the icons what you had uh, earlier now in spite of trying all these steps in case if you're still facing a problem then what i would suggest you to do is i would go ahead and uh, suggest you to go ahead and check your system time so what you can do is uh, uh, press open task manager by using control escape control shift escape click on file click on run new task and type control as soon as you hit control, uh, you will have the control panel open on your screen. Now here you can click on date and time. Under date and time, you can go ahead and select change date and time. Make sure you have the date and time in sync with, uh, with your clock settings. And then you can click on internet time, click on change settings. Make sure you click on update now and click on OK. That should sync your time with your current uh, time on your computer that will sync your time between your machine and the actual time so once that is done restart the computer and check if the issue resolve this should resolve the problem so uh, so all these steps will help you to fix your problem in case if you still have a problem i would suggest you to leave a comment in the comment section i will be more than happy to get back to you with a possible solution I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.